People would ask me why my body, why the erotics, why the mask. It was just, it was in sort of intuitive. Okay, so let's talk about it. Okay, about the name? Yeah. So I wanted to pick a name that in some way pointed to the fact that I'm a person of color, a woman of color, a sister. So I started flipping through dictionary. The word narcissist jumped out at me. I grew up in Southern California where it was like white women with blonde hair. My mother was a Sephardic Jew from Morocco and my father was African American from LA. I had so much sort of self-hatred that I was brown, that I my hair was curly and that I had these weird parents. Can you say something about what your mother meant to you? Yeah, um, and I mean, until she passed away, I mean, that was the primary relationship in my life. My mother's presence fueled my ambition, fueled very much what I felt was possible. She had such an incredible intellect and critical mind and helping me understand what I was trying to say in a deeper sense with my work. And what I'm doing with my work is saying to myself, I have no limitations. I can put things in my vagina. I can traverse taboos. I have no limits on my physical body, on my womanhood, on my identity that I will accept.